and welcome to CFC Fan TV. Now we're still outside the bridge and we thought we'd all give you a Sunday video on Hudson Odoi. Bearing in mind we've just seen a very, very good performance from him. As you know, a great performance from him. So as you know, Bayern have offered 30 million. It's soon to be what 40 million, did you say, Charles? 40, yeah. That's and we yeah. yeah, and we just cannot we cannot let him leave, can we? Absolutely not. You know, I I think he's one of the most talented kids to come through the Chelsea system in 10 years. I mean, we, we, we saw that generation of McEachran and Chaloba and they've all moved on and we've kind of lost that generation a little bit. We cannot do the same with the best players from this generation. And if, if hudson Adoy leads to Bayern Munich, I, I, I think it's such a bad indicator for the academy and the future of the academy. And, it's, it's, you know, this isn't like Watford wanting hudson Adoy. It's Bayern Munich. Yeah, which is wild. You, you, you know, it's one of the best teams in Europe. Um, Charlie, he's got, do you know what? Right? I agree with everything you say, but just to play devil's advocate... If you make 40 million quid, like you said, it's a sad indicator on the on what the you know, youth setup is. If we make 40 million pounds, think how much money that is, by the way, 40 million. If you make 40 million pounds for, for a lad who's played less than a dozen games for the club, that, no. isn't, that isn't only failure. I mean, I, look, I don't want him to leave and I don't yeah, think he yeah. should leave and, and I completely agree with what you're saying, but just to play devil's advocate, I mean, that sets the, that sets the youth system up, the youth uh, setup up for decades to come, that money. But, I mean, do, do, do you, no, I do you trust Chelsea to spend that wisely? Yeah, they will. Go and spend before. 35 million on Bakayoko again. Do you know what I mean? Chelsea, I see Red Bulls. They are Red Bulls. Yeah, yeah. Well, I, I, asked, I asked for their opinion. <laughs> I can see why they've come up with that summary, having seen your new jacket. <laughs> he's, Rory, he's on thin ice. Rory, Rory honestly, <laughs> is the worst dresser <laughs> I've ever known. Sorry. Sammy, Honestly, Rory, Sammy, it really is horrendous. Wait, wait, anyway, uh, to be back on track. Uh, although I said How you're married before me, I'll never know. <laughs> listen, uh, no, l listen, the, the, Charlie, you made an excellent... Stuart gave you them. Yeah, yeah I, I love my little oranges. Listen, uh, Charlie, I completely agree with you. I don't think Chelsea will spend the money wisely. I think the club needs to look at this as in, if Bayern Munich, a huge club like Bayern Munich, are... Sniffing around a player. Yeah, yeah like him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That should automatically make you go, actually, yeah, God, line, why would we get rid of but, him? Put it this way, right? If... Hudson Odoi was a young player at Dortmund, and we had Pulisic. Don't you think we'd be trying to get Hudson Odoi? Yeah, which is which and, is and, and, and what have we done? We spent sixty million. Ch Charlie, to put you on a spot, right? Just because I think this this needs some diff, sort of definitive language. Right. Are Chelsea trying to sell Hudson Odoi? No, I think they'd love to keep Hudson Odoi. I don't think Hudson Odoi wants to sign a new contract because I think he believes he'll get first team football elsewhere. Looking at the example of Jaden Sancho who he feels that he is a level above and their youth careers they're the same age their youth careers would suggest that Hudson Nodoy is a level above right. Jaden Sancho and Sancho is absolutely tearing it up the thing is though he's right to say that he feels like he should be getting first team football because yeah. we've just watched him and he clearly should be getting first team yeah, football yeah. the question is are Chelsea going to give him that first team opportunity and they probably should considering the options that are there in front of him in, in fairness I don't for a player his age which is very young it's 18 you've got to think this is one of the biggest clubs in the world I don't actually think his opportunities have been that limited this season it's certainly more than we've seen an 18 year old play for, for a long long time you know he's, he's, he's played he started cup games he's come on in the league I appreciate it's not he's not playing every week and some of the displays, like you said, some of the displays we've seen from like William and Pedro and, and whoever else um, might suggest that he might be playing more, but I don't think he's had like no opportunities, you know? No, he's not had no opportunities, but I think if you've got a club like Bayern sniffing around him, then that should say that he probably should have been given a few more. It's not like, I mean, I suppose with Lewis Baker, he's, he's a great player, but it's but, I mean, look, where it wasn't but, a huge club like, like Bayern so yeah but I mean Lewis, Lewis Baker is, is not getting in the team on, on his loan deal I, I, and he's, he's obviously three four years older than Hudson Odoi and we'll have to see where Hudson Odoi is in three four years and that's the generation I was talking about that we've slightly lost yeah. so we can't do the same with this generation yeah uh, don't you think Hudson Odoi would be worth more in the future if we did play yeah, him more and then if he wants to leave then we'd have him even more money to spend on somebody half decent but I don't think he would I think he'd want to stay yeah I mean the, the money chat is something that I'm not very good at and something that I don't really enjoy doing I like to talk about footballers and goals and things that happen on a pitch and late challenges and drop balls heavily contested in all right mate how are you right that, that's what I enjoy about football so if, if you want to talk about the finances of the game I'm not really the man for it I don't care about your profit. I don't care about that, that level of football. What I care about is, can you contribute to the first team? And Callum Hudson-Odoi clearly can contribute to the first team. And for that reason alone, I hope he stays at the club. But crucially, I hope he gets his opportunity and he should be, on, he should be in the first 11 next time Chelsea kick a ball.
Well, yeah, 100%. Okay, guys, comment below and let us know what you think of Hudson Adoy. We're obviously all full of praise here for him, and um, we just hope he doesn't leave, don't we, Charles? Absolutely, mate. Absolutely, mate.